what's up welcome on back to my channel thank you so much for clicking this important video today I am going to be talking to you about the current mod news that is going on in our sims community first things first don't panic this isn't a video to get you nervous or scared about downloading mods or CC and most importantly this is not, and I repeat, this is not affecting all mods and custom content. Only a handful, and everyone in the community has been notified, and they are all aware, and we are all working on it to protect your mods folder. So now, let's just jump right in and get to the info. When did this all begin? Well, it started around the end of January, okay? First off, um, Ma The Sims had put out this post and it states, warning, do not download cult mod version four from mod the sims um, and mod was uploaded appearing on the surface to be an updated version of the cult mod from pimp my sims 4 however everything about the upload is suspicious once that was put out the whole entire community was aware endless endless amounts of notifications has been up in the interwebs this one by tsr a very popular website that most of us download custom content from and even mods has put out a statement they are aware of the recent malicious mods that have been popping up in the community including some that managed to get onto tsr they have removed all known instances so everyone is once again aware of the situation and are implementing action to take care of it okay guys here is the current list of the mods that are affected one cult mod by pip m sims um social events unlimited time by my sims 4 this was on curse verge weather and forecast cheat menu by msq sims that was on tsr seasons cheat menu mother load menu mood cheat menu all on tsr also there is a mouth preset n16 um that is a custom content that was also on tsr and the latest one is the cult sex mod and that was on lovers lab guys in the next chapter of this video i'm going to discuss how to find out if you have been infected and also how to protect your mods folder and your pc from here on i'm going to show you how you can check to see if you have been infected by malware the first thing you need to do is go to your keyboard and select the windows button along with the letter r so you're going to click the windows button and the letter r at the exact same time you now have a prompt in front of you where you can run this um command and the command is parentheses app data parentheses microsoft slash internet space explorer slash user data you are then going to click ok a folder will pop up inside of this folder if you have a file that is named updater exe you have been compromised your information has been compromised and i will suggest you update all your passwords delete any important information get a program that will protect you from the malware all right guys there's also a statement that was put out um by the sims after dark um stating that if you were compromised um they would suggest you um 
uninstall discord and uninstall any crypto wallet um applications that you may have basically it states further investigations suggest that the malware tries to infect discord and crypto wallet programs and simply removing the malicious um exe file may not be enough if they are infected running discord or the crypto wallet will attempt to reapply the malware to your device so if you were affected by the promise mods you should also uninstall discord and the crypto wallet program and then once you are sure the malware is gone reinstall them from a fresh download to clear out any remnants in the next chapter guys i'm going to show you programs that will help protect you from malware and any viruses on your pc protecting that mods folder here are my top three um, programs subscription programs that you can purchase to protect your pc and all of your important files and folders First up we have is Bitdefender. It has different various um, subscription packages that you can purchase to protect your PC. The latest is the ultimate uh, security for $89.99. It will scan malware for you and it also will scan viruses for you. All right, next up is Norton. They have been around for many, many years protecting people's PCs all over the world. Um, yeah, so go ahead and go to their website. They have various um, packages that you can go ahead and pick which one that is best for you. Next one that I have is McAfee. I personally have this program on my computer. I've had it for years. Um, they do a whole lot of protection for different types of things, VPNs, viruses, malware, ransomware, you name it they got it they are protecting you overall privacy protection as well um price ranges from forty dollars all the way to almost two hundred dollars it is very expensive if you get the like big package so um go ahead go to mcafee research um and see which one best fits you also malware bites um is highly recommended for anyone with a mac PC. I wanted to get that in there as well. Um, prices seem to be reasonable. Um, it definitely protects you from malware. Next chapter, I'm going to be sharing with you the discords and websites that I highly recommend to keep you informed. Okay, guys, so here are the discords and websites that I highly recommend um, you have um, available to you because they give the most accurate and the latest information when it comes to anything concerning your mods and CC. So number one is Twisted Mexi. This is in no particular order. This is just me listing them. Um, and then we have Deadpool. Uh, if you join Deadpool's Discord, and you have your own discord you can simply just follow whichever channel on Deadpool's um discord that you want to follow and you will get the update um sims after dark as well also if you have a favorite creator um whether they are a cc creator or a mods creator i highly recommend you um follow their discord i am a fan of a deep indigo along with sim realist so i also have those discords available to me especially if there is a new mod of theirs that i have downloaded and for any questions that i may have or of any um better exceptions that may have come up about that particular mod you can always go and um ask them and and they're very very helpful and last but not least we have um scarlet rum i've talked about this website so many times throughout um my videos this is the website this is my go-to this is my bible this is um who i go to to update me on any mod um, information and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you the website all right guys as you can see here I'm on Scarlet Rim's website they have the malware mod info everything that you could possibly um, need as far as critical information concerning any mod um, updates any bad mods um, things to be aware of um, 
things that can protect you from um, malware or any type of viruses, websites, and tools to go to. It's all right here at Scholars Realms website in the section stated malware mod info. So go ahead and look up the website, check it out, and everything is there for you. All right, guys, and the last section of this video, we are going to be talking about the Mod Guard by Twisted Mexi. All right, guys, it's real simple. We are here at Twisted Mexi's Patreon Mod Guard um, version. This is 1.3 as of today, February 12th. That is the latest version. Always make sure and check that there haven't been any new updates and that you always have the latest version. Now, what this mod does is it prevents common virus vectors. It finds the responsible mod. It notifies the user of the promised mod and it alerts Twisted Mexi's team of the compromise mod so um nothing is a hundred percent guaranteed that is with everything i've mentioned even even the the nortons and the mcafees at these big um virus um companies nothing is a hundred percent guaranteed but this is a way to shield your pc and your mods folder and i highly recommend it and i urge you if you are the, uh, the type of simmer who downloads mods or even if you just only download custom content i urge you to get this mod it is a must have inside of your mods folder it's simple you just download the file unzip it take the script file and put it directly inside of your mods folder how do you know you have downloaded and everything is working properly when you go into your game all right guys so when you load up your game uh the menu of the mod guard would appear in the top right corner with all of your notifications it will also show the current version that you have um it basically just says that is now um monitoring your mods folder and anything that goes wrong it will alert you and basically has twisted mexi's website on the bottom along with their patreon that you can just click and just have easy access to all right guys there's also another option if you do use curse verge um you have the opportunity to download the sims virus cleaner what it does is just simple it protects your computer your mods folder from any malware you won't be alerted of which mods it is it just simply protects you from the jump that is what they are saying um i don't personally have the curse first app but i just wanted you guys to be aware of all options available to you all right guys i hope this video was informative to you if you have any questions at all feel free to comment below as usual i will have the links in the description below of anything that i have mentioned in this video and also know that the modders and the custom content creators are still out there they are bringing you brand new mods and custom content for your gameplay um, but always, always be aware of where you download these mods and custom contents from, okay? If you are new and you haven't had a chance, please hit that subscribe button. And my name is Samarala, and I hope you guys have a great day. I'm signing out. Bye, guys.